Tenofovir alafenamide, also known as Vemlidi, is used to treat chronic hepatitis B infection, which is a viral infection of the liver. It works by stopping or slowing the growth of the virus. Chronic hepatitis B infection can lead to serious liver damage, such as cirrhosis and liver cancer. It is not known if Vemlidi can cure hepatitis B or can prevent you from passing the virus to others. It is important to practice safer sex by using latex condoms to lower the risk of passing the virus to others. The recommended daily dosage of Vemlidi is one tablet taken orally once a day. It can be taken with or without food, but it is important to take it at the same time every day to maintain a consistent level of the medication in your body. If you have any concerns about taking Vemlidi or questions about the best time to take it, it is important to consult with your healthcare provider for personalized advice. Before starting treatment with Vemlidi, your doctor will test you for HIV infection. If you have both HIV and hepatitis B, Vemlidi should not be used alone, as this may make it harder to treat your HIV infection. Combination drug treatment is always used to treat HIV infection. Take Vemlidi by mouth with food, usually once daily. If you are on dialysis, take your daily dose following dialysis. The dosage is based on your medical condition, response to treatment, and other medications you may be taking. Take Vemlidi at the same time every day for the best effect. If you vomit within one hour after taking a dose, take another dose. If vomiting occurs more than one hour after taking your dose, do not take another dose. Do not take more or less of this drug than prescribed or stop taking it unless directed to do so by your doctor. Doing so may make the infection worse or harder to treat, or worsen side effects. Some common side effects of Vemlidi include headache, nausea, tiredness, or cough. If any of these effects persist or worsen, notify your doctor or pharmacist promptly. It's important to remember that your doctor has prescribed this medication because they have determined that the benefits to you outweigh the potential risks of side effects. Many people who use Vemlidi do not experience serious side effects. However, it's crucial to inform your doctor right away if you experience any serious side effects, such as changes in mood, signs of kidney problems, or unusual thirst. Rarely, Vemlidi can cause severe liver and blood problems, so it's important to seek immediate medical attention if you develop symptoms such as nausea or vomiting, loss of appetite, stomach pain, yellowing of the eyes or skin, or unusual weakness. While a serious allergic reaction to Vemlidi is rare, it's important to get medical help immediately if you notice any symptoms such as rash, swelling, severe dizziness, or trouble breathing. Keep in mind that this is not a complete list of possible side effects, so be sure to contact your doctor or pharmacist if you experience any other effects. If you're in the US, call your doctor for medical advice about any side effects. You can also report side effects to the FDA. In Canada, you can call your doctor for medical advice and report side effects to Health Canada. If you stop taking Vemlidi, your hepatitis B symptoms may worsen or become more severe. It's important to talk to your doctor before stopping this medication. Your doctor will monitor your liver function for several months after you stop taking Vemlidi to ensure your condition remains stable. Before taking Vemlidi, make sure to inform your doctor or pharmacist if you have any allergies. This medication may contain inactive ingredients that could cause allergic reactions or other issues, so it's important to discuss this with your pharmacist. Also, let your doctor or pharmacist know about your medical history, especially if you have kidney problems, HIV infection, liver problems, bone problems, or pancreas disease. If you are planning to have surgery, be sure to inform your doctor or dentist about all the medications and products you are using. If you are pregnant, only use this medication if it is clearly needed. It's important to discuss the risks and benefits with your doctor. If you are breastfeeding, consult your doctor before using Vemlidi, as it is not known whether this medication passes into breast milk. When taking Vemlidi, it's important to be aware of potential drug interactions that could affect how the medication works or increase the risk of serious side effects. It's essential to keep a list of all the products you use and share it with your doctor and pharmacist, including prescription slash non-prescription drugs and herbal products. Do not start, stop, or change the dosage of any medicines without your doctor's approval. Some products that may interact with Vemlidi include Adifovir, Orlistat, and other drugs that may harm the kidneys, such as aminoglycosides like amikacin and gentamicin. 
It's also important to avoid taking this medication with other products that contain tenofovir. As for the daily dosage, the typical recommended dose of Vemlity is one tablet, 25 mg, taken once daily with food. It's best to take the medication at the same time each day to help maintain a consistent level in your body. Vemlity is used to treat chronic hepatitis B virus infection in adults and children 12 years of age and older. This medication helps to reduce the amount of hepatitis B virus in the body and may lower the ability of the virus to multiply and infect new liver cells. It is not a cure for hepatitis B, but it may help to reduce the risk of liver damage and liver cancer. If someone has taken too much Vemlity and is experiencing severe symptoms like fainting or difficulty breathing, it's important to seek immediate medical help. In the U.S., you can call 911 for emergency assistance or contact your local poison control center at 1-800-222-1222. Canadian residents can reach out to their provincial poison control center for assistance. It's important not to share Vemlity with others. Before starting Vemlity, you may need to undergo some lab and medical tests, such as kidney and liver function tests, urine glucose and protein tests, hepatitis B virus level tests, blood mineral level tests, and bone density tests. It's important to keep all your medical and lab appointments and consult your doctor for more details. If you forget to take a dose of Vemlity, and it's been less than 18 hours since you were supposed to take it, go ahead and take it as soon as you remember. But if it's been longer than 18 hours, just skip the missed dose and take your next dose at the regular time. Don't try to make up for the missed dose by taking extra. When taking Vemlity, it is important to store it in the original container at room temperature, away from light and moisture. Do not keep it in the bathroom, and be sure to keep it out of reach of children and pets. If you no longer need the medication or it has expired, be sure to properly discard it. You can consult your pharmacist or local waste disposal company for the best way to do this. If you need more help, call your doctor for medical advice. In the US, you call FDA, 1-800-FDA-1088. In Canada, you may call Health Canada, 1-866-234-2345. Wishing you good health. Thanks for watching.